Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the fourth tutorial in this course. In this tutorial, we are going to talk about the paragraph uh, tags and also the break tag or the line break tag uh, in HTML. Right, so uh, I've saved this file already. It has the name uh, tutorial-4.html and uh, on line one, I have the doc type declaration. On line uh, two, I have the opening HTML tag and on line 11, I have the closing HTML tag and between these two tags, I have the head section, the body section. And the title of this web page is paragraph and line breaks. And uh, in the body section, I have two uh, paragraphs. Uh, and of course, I've used the P tag. And uh, this is something that I discussed in the first tutorial in this course. So to have a paragraph in HTML, uh, you know, you need to use the P tag within the body section. And uh, you write text between the opening P tag, which is just the alphabet P and the closing P tag, which is the alphabet P, uh, uh, you know, proceeded with a forward slash, right? So this is how the web page would look, uh, you know, if you would open it in a web browser. So you have first paragraph and then, you know, some break and then you have the second paragraph. Now, let's say, you know, you do not have a, a separate paragraph for uh, the second paragraph, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of uh, this paragraph, opening paragraph tag here and uh, also the closing paragraph tag here. So I'll save this file now and I just have one paragraph. And as I said, HTML is case, uh, sorry, is, is white space insensitive. So, uh, you know, all this white space uh, between um, the first paragraph and the second paragraph is not going to show up in the browser. And uh, I'll just refresh my page here. And there you go, you see that you have first paragraph and then second paragraph displayed on the same line. Now let's say you want these to appear on different lines, but you also do not want to have a separate paragraph. So the way you do that is by using the line break tag or the BR tag. And it's one of the most popular tags in HTML. And uh, it's the cutest tag too, if you ask me. So, you know, all you have to do is have the less than the greater than symbols and type in BR between these a space and a forward slash, right? It's as simple as that. I'll save my document. And when I refresh it in my browser, I see that second paragraph is displayed on the next line and it doesn't have as much space as it had earlier when I used different paragraphs for the two statements, right? So these are, you know, two of the most used uh, tags uh, elements in HTML and uh, we'll be using them extensively in this course. And I'm sure, you know, if you make a career in web development, you would use them uh, a lot, uh, you know, uh, in the web pages that you make. So anyway, I'm going to see you in the next tutorial now in which uh, we'll discuss, uh, you know, some more features of HTML. And I hope you guys had fun watching this tutorial and you may subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care.